Hey music enthusiasts, welcome back to Top Niger Life where we unravel the magic behind melodies of music world. It's your girl Daughter Ways and today we are stepping into the heart of Nigeria's music production scene to celebrate the unsung heroes, the producers. From crafting infectious beats to sculpting sonic landscapes, these masters are the backbone of the industry. <laughs> when is this beat I want to play now, eh? as I play it for a lot of people and Nobody, everybody just saying like, eh, is that, they don't know what to do with it, so let me just, mm -hmm. let me see. Here you go. Sauce on the beat! Baby, I get you plenty money, I will buy you all you want. Sauce on the beat, sauce on the beat, sauce, sauce on the beat. Before we dive in, make sure to hit the subscription button and ring that notification bell for your backstage pass to the rhythm. Let's get started on the top 10 music producers yeah, in Nigeria. The significance of music producers in Nigeria is shaping the industry, their role in elevating artists' careers. A music producer is involved in every stage of recording music, from pre-production, where they determine what type of recording will be made and with whom, to post-production, where they oversee edits and mixing and supervise song selections are sequencing. In most cases, producers are either self-employed or have established relationships with the record labels. They be paid past songs or receive royalties based on the sales or airplay of record produced by them. Now, music producers play a huge role in shaping the industry. They can help an artist's career take off by elevating their sound, advising them on artistic choices, and giving them valuable feedbacks. They are also great at getting artists' music to the right people, which can open bigger doors to bigger people and better opportunities. And they are usually pretty cool people to work with. And number 10 is Key Dominance. Key dominance without a question among the most popular and well-liked music producers in Nigeria. He has written hit tracks for numerous Nigerian singers including Mayoko, Whiskey, Davido and others. He is well known for his unique method to combine various musical genres to create an intriguing and original tone. Key dominance has won numerous awards and has been nominated both locally and internationally as a result of his talent and commitment. Number 9. Mastercraft Mastercraft was born Sunday Guinea Kachuku, is a Nigerian music producer and songwriter. A lot of them are always songwriters. He has produced numerous hit tracks and popular artists and he has won several awards for his work. Mastercraft's style and signature sound incorporate elements of Afro, high life and hip hop. His influence on the Nigerian music scene can be seen in ways that he brings unique flavors to his productions. Blending various genres seamlessly, he can call himself the king of his own spaces. Now I'll give you a few songs that was produced by Mastercraft. Fada Fada, Yawa, Far Away, Two People. Now moving on to number 8, Don Jazzy. Don Jazzy Michael Collins, known professionally as Don Jazzy, is a Nigerian record producer, brand ambassador, audio engineering, record executive, singer, entrepreneur, influencer, and comedian. He is the founder of the CEO of Mavens Record. But yes, Don Jazzy is a producer and he has produced numerous songs for numerous artists. His associated acts are The Band, Dr. Sid, The Prince, Tiwa Savage, Ricardo Banz, Corey De Bello, Deja, Rema, Johnny Drill, Ladipo, Arasta, and Bonaboy. So you can see that he has been making a lot of sounds underground. And he is also very popular too for the cackles of people who know him. Now moving on to number 7. Shinzi frequently works with David Doe. His appearance on a Good Time album is notable. His most popular songs in 2021 was Fireboy Peru which later debuted at number one on the UK charts and reached the Billboard chart. Shizu is not just someone who's just starting, he's someone who has been there and his works can be seen from his notable um, sounds that he brings out. They are so vibrant and so sweet. Now moving on to number six, Saz. Saz hits the prominence through his hit single, 
Jaw. In 2013, he produced two songs of Whiskey's album, Jai Jai, featuring Femi Kuti and Kolefe. He was mentioned as one of the five new music producers giving Don Jazzy a run for his money. Sals was reported to have signed an endorsement deal with Nike later that year. Now, Sals was the executive producer for the official NSC Artistry 2014 theme, so that was the second segment. Now we are moving on to the third segment. After counting down from 10 to 6, we are going to have the spotlights for 5 to number 1. But before we do that, there are a lot of notable mentions that we can mention. Napji. Napji is one of the best music producers in Nigeria currently and is also the most popular music producer from the northern Nigeria. Napji is the brain behind some of the hit tracks of Davido's A Better Time album. Yes, you heard me well. He's also known for his signature intro, Napki Killing This One. He is the first producer of Femme and Jawa, P Prime. P Prime is also among the best producers in Nigeria music industry currently. He has thrived under guidance of top Nigeria veteran music producer Sars. P Prime has worked with Naramali, Zlatan, Olamide and Fireboy and he has produced some of the top tunes in Nigeria music industry like Infinity by Olamide featuring Omale. Now you can see that they are young and also been doing a lot of things that people do not actually know. Now let's move on to the third segment which is counting down from number five to number one number five feels feels is also known as philip coyote moses he is a nigerian music producer he has worked with several a-list artists and has produced hit songs that have topped the chart Phil's styles and signature sound incorporate elements of Afrobeat, hip hop, and high life music. His influence on the Nigerian music scene is evident in the unique and innovative sound that he brings to his productions. Now, songs that was produced by Phil's Finesse, High, Somebody, Champion, Plenty, Naughty Girl, and Wayward Girl. Now you can see that all the songs that I mentioned are songs that keeps you on your toes and keeps you dancing. Number four, Techno. Yes, I'm sure you're surprised. Techno producer, yes, he's more than just an artist and a songwriter. He is a producer. Now, do you know that Techno is one of the producers of a Good Time album by David O? Did you know? The Good Time album is the second studio album by Nigerian singer David O. It was released in November 2022, 2019 through DMV. That's DMW. Also, Techno is one of the producers of Ijela the Traveler album by Flavor. But do you also know that Techno is one of the producers of Just to the World album by Ice Brains? Yes, another person he produced for. Now, do you also know that Techno is one of the producers of one of his own music album, Old Romance? If you listen to that album, you will know that there is nobody else that could sound like that except for Techno. Now, Old Romance is the debut studio album by Nigerian singer songwriter Techno, and it was released 10th December 2020 by Island Record and the Cartel Entertainment. The album combines elements of R&B and Afropop with neo soul persuasive rhythm. Recently the queen tiwa of afrobeat was caught on calm declaring techno as the baddest in production while listening to a beat techno produced now have i been able to convince you and not also to confuse you that techno is not just a singer and not just a producer but a good bad one at that moving on to number three rexy Rexy sits on the number three spot today. His full name is Eze Chisom, who is professionally called Rexy. Now, he is one of Nigeria's biggest and most popular music producers currently. Music producer was brought to the limelight of his work with the Malian community in Nigerian music industry. He produced the following hit song, Sopi, Teshimole, and Beko. Rexy has worked with some of the biggest artists in Nigeria, like Tiwa Savage, Neramali, Zlatan, and Bonaboy. Like, he has worked to notable artists a-listers and not even just um upcoming rexy also have picked up events and has picked up many awards making him one of the most sought after music producers in nigeria i hope i did a little good job there what do you mean by that number two young john 
Young John, aka The Wicked Producer, is a singer, songwriter, and a producer signed to Chocolate City Music. Lately, he has been singing a lot of amazing songs, dropping songs back to back. It's Young John, The Wicked Producer. He's recognized for his hit Dada and the song remix with David O. Songs produced by Young John as Street OT, Two Kings, The Baddest, um, Rora, and Mama. So you could see that all these songs were songs that was always giving us this um good vibes and good mood so he's not just um a singer but he's also a producer john has had music production credits on industry hits since 2010 and was a signee in ybnl going on to rank number three on the net list of nigeria's top biggest music producers he is also nominated in the producer of the year category at the 2015 nigeria entertainment awards of the headies 2015 now moving on to number one Kelpie Udoma Peter Kelvin, professionally known as Kelpie, is a Nigerian recording producer and singer with songwriter. Kelpie became a Nigerian influencer and is best known for producing the Grammy nominated and winning the world album African Giant in 2019. Kelpie also co produced the Grammy award winning beats for the global music album for Mother Nature by Angelique Kijo and Whiskey for his song that has been nominated for Made in Lagos Dulex version. Kelpie had a partnership with Universal Music Group as we conclude our exploration of the top most successful beat record labels in Nigeria, it is essential to recognize the crucial role that producers play in the music industry. Producers are the unsung heroes behind the scenes, responsible for shaping the sound and the direction of a song or album. Without their creativity and technical expertise, many of the hit songs we know and love today would not exist. So let's take this moment to appreciate the incredible work of producers and give them the recognition they deserve. Who is your favorite producer? Share their names in the comment section below and let's celebrate their contribution to the music industry. Thank you for joining me on this journey through the world of Nigerian music. It has been an incredible experience exploring these stories and achievements of these producers. Your support and engagement mean a world to me. Remember to like, comment and subscribe and stay tuned on future content. I'll be back with more exciting videos soon. Until then, keep enjoying the incredible music coming out of Nigeria and do not forget to appreciate the producers. If you have time, let's give them a resounding round of applause. Stay tuned and thank you again. 